A short-range ballistic missile stands for SRBM is designed for rapid deployment and is typically used for tactical battlefield engagements. These missiles have a range of up to 1,000 km and are crucial for quick, precise strikes during conflicts. Both India's Prithvi-2 and Pakistan's Shaheen-1 fall under this category, making them essential components of their respective nations' defense strategies. While it's true that Shaheen-1 boasts a longer range and certain advanced capabilities, it's important to compare these missiles to understand their roles and technological differences. Despite Prithvi-2 being comparatively less powerful in certain areas, its indigenous development and flexibility in various battlefield scenarios make it a unique asset for India's defense. So, let's dive into this comparison to explore both missile strengths and contributions to national security. Shaheen-1 is one of Pakistan's primary short-range ballistic missiles, developed to enhance its strategic defense capabilities. It is a key component of Pakistan's missile arsenal, serving as a deterrent and providing a quick response option in regional security dynamics. On the other hand, Prithvi-2 is India's indigenously developed short-range ballistic missile, created under the Integrated Guided Missile Development Program. This missile highlights India's focus on tactical defense and self-reliance in military technology, ensuring readiness for rapid deployment in various defense scenarios. Coming to the size and weight, Prithvi-2 is relatively smaller, with a length of 8.56 meters, a diameter of 1.1 meters, and a weight of around 4,600 kilograms, its compact dimensions make it more mobile and easier to deploy, especially in rapid battlefield situations, the lighter weight enhances its maneuverability during flight, making it more agile in tactical scenarios. On the other hand, Shaheen-1 is significantly larger and heavier, with a length of 12 meters, a diameter of 1 meter, and a weight of approximately 9,500 kilograms, its larger size allows it to carry a heavier payload and travel longer distances, though it may slightly compromise its mobility compared to Prit V2, Shaheen-1 clearly has an edge when it comes to payload and range. Talking about range and speed, Prit V2 has a range of around 250 to 350 kilometers, making it effective for short-range engagements. Its speed is approximately Mach 1.5, or 1.5 times the speed of sound. This makes Prit V2 suitable for close-range, tactical strikes, especially in battlefield scenarios where rapid deployment is crucial. On the other hand, Shaheen-1 surpasses Prit V2 with a longer range of up to 750 km and a much faster speed of Mach 5, classifying it as a hypersonic missile, its greater range and speed make it more effective for longer-distance strikes, giving Shaheen-1 a clear advantage in terms of reach and rapid strike capabilities. Let's talk about the warhead capabilities. Prit V2 can carry both conventional and nuclear warheads, with a payload capacity ranging between 500 and 1000 kilograms. This flexibility allows it to be used in various combat scenarios, from tactical strikes to strategic deterrence with nuclear capabilities. Similarly, Shaheen-1 can also carry both nuclear and conventional warheads with a payload capacity of up to 1000 kilograms. When we talk about destructive power, both missiles can cause a blast radius of 100 to 500 meters with conventional warheads. However, when equipped with nuclear warheads, the destruction expands significantly. Depending on the yield, a nuclear blast could cause devastation over a radius of 1 to 10 kilometers. In this aspect, both missiles are equally destructive, but Shaheen-1's larger payload capacity gives it an advantage in delivering greater force. When we talk about engines, Prit V2 uses a liquid-fueled engine, offering better control and precision during flight. However, liquid-fueled engines require more time for preparation before launch, as the fuel must be loaded just before deployment. This can limit the missile's readiness in quick launch scenarios. On the other hand, Shaheen-1 benefits from a solid-fueled engine, which provides quicker launch times and easier storage since the fuel is already loaded. This allows for faster deployment giving Shaheen-1 a clear edge in terms of rapid response situations. Talking about guidance systems, Prit V2 uses an inertial guidance system, which relies on internal sensors to adjust its flight path. While this system makes the missile harder to jam, its accuracy diminishes over long distances due to sensor errors, resulting in a circular error probable of about 50 meters. On the other hand, Shaheen-1 employs a more advanced inertial guidance system, achieving a higher accuracy with a CEP of around 25 meters, 
This greater precision allows Shaheen 1 to hit targets more accurately, making it superior in terms of guidance and accuracy. When we talk about launch platforms, both Prit V2 and Shaheen 1 are launched from mobile land based transporter erector launchers. This mobility allows for flexible deployment, making the missiles harder to detect and neutralize. Both missiles benefit from this mobility, but given Shaheen 1's longer range, it can be deployed from farther away, providing a strategic advantage and operational flexibility. Talking about maneuverability, Prit V2 benefits from its liquid fueled engine, which allows for small adjustments mid flight enhancing its control. However, being a ballistic missile, its ability to maneuver is limited once it reaches its trajectory. On the other hand, Shaheen 1 has less maneuverability due to its solid-fueled engine, which provides rapid acceleration but limits mid-flight adjustments. While neither missile is designed for evasive maneuvers, Prit V2 offers slightly better mid-flight flexibility, though Shaheen 1 compensates with its speed and range. Let's speak about the cost where Prit V2 is more affordable, with an estimated production cost of $500,000 to $1 million per missile. This makes it a cost-effective option for India's defense strategy, especially in large-scale deployment scenarios. On the other hand, Shaheen 1 is more expensive, with each missile costing between $2 million and $3 million. This higher cost reflects its advanced solid fuel technology, greater range, and improved accuracy making it a more premium option for Pakistan's strategic arsenal. In conclusion, while Shaheen 1 often has the edge in terms of range, speed, and technology, Prit V2 remains a highly valuable asset for India with its mobility, affordability, and precision. Understanding the strengths of both missiles provides insights into how India and Pakistan tailor their defense strategies to their unique needs and challenges. Which missile do you think has the edge in modern combat scenarios? Let us know in the comments below. That's it for today's comparison. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe for more defense updates and comparisons. See you in the next video.